Hey everyone, Digital David here today. In this video, we're gonna be comparing the TAC Life Tools KP120 Jump Starter to the TAC Life Tools KP200 Jump Starter. I wanted to give you guys a quick side-by-side -side comparison of both of these products. Now, TAC Life Tools did send me these items to review, but any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. If you're interested in any of the products you see here today, the links to them will be in my video description below. Please go ahead, check them out, and do your shopping from there. So here we go, here's a side-by-side -side comparison. You can see the KP120 is a little bit smaller box and size-wise versus the KP200 right there, but they do have identical packaging. So we can check all that out. Now let's go ahead, let's look at the package contents. So here are all the package contents. Both have user manuals in multiple languages. Both have identical intelligent clamps. Both feature the same charging cables and power supply. We have USB type A to USB type C and a USB type C to USB type C cable. Both have the 15 volt cigarette lighter adapter. And then we have both of the jump starters right here. So they share a very similar design. Obviously the KP200 is longer. It's not any taller necessarily, but it does feel a little bit rounder and less sharp than the design of the KP120 as you can see. They do have some different design elements missing, but they are very similar. Logo, branding, everything up top, four indicator lights, and your power button. We can look at them from this side too. So we can see both have a flashlight, both have a USB Type-C in out port, and two USB Type-A ports, but you can see they are rotated. We have an orange and a black, and then we have a white and an orange right there. We can flip them over as well, so you can see this side. Very similar again, but they are different. This one's rounded, this one's square and flat right there. We can look at this side too, so you can see that. Then we can look at this side, where you put the jumper cable right there. So they're gonna have the same jumper cable ports. So we can open that up so you guys can see. So they'll fit either one. And then you can see the grips are just a little bit different depending on which device you get. And there we go, we have our 15 volt port right there too. And same thing, a little bit different in the design, but overall very similar. So a couple of the key differences have to do with the power. So first up, we have 1200 peak amps right here versus 2000 peak amps. This supports up to eight liter gas engines and six liter diesel engines, where the KP200 supports all sizes of gas engines and up to seven liters for diesel engines. And then the last major difference, the KP120 has 12,800 milliamp hour battery capacity, while the KP200 has 16,800 milliamp hour battery capacity. So 4,000 additional milliamp hour. So it's definitely a bigger and beefier machine spec wise, but not that much form factor wise. I do a full review on both of these items on my channel, so be sure to check out those videos. Well, that concludes our video. Thank you so much for watching, and don't forget the product link will be in our video description below. Please go ahead, check it out, and do your shopping from there. Any purchase made through that link helps support our channel at no additional cost to you, and we're really grateful and thankful for all of your support. While you're at it, can you go ahead and hit that like button for us? and subscribe to our channel. We have new content coming out daily and we don't want you to miss anything going on around here. Drop a comment below too. We can't wait to hear from you guys. And while you're at it, please follow us online, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, WeChat, Discord, TikTok. You can even check out our website and join our free newsletter. Thank you so much for watching and we can't wait to see you in our next video.